scientists are turning climate disaster zones into actionable data that could help us in the future. Welcome back to Moonshot Monday, where we talk about breakthrough technologies in deep tech. Today we are talking about LIDAR, light detection and ranging. This technology shoots laser pulses and measures bounce back time to create ultra precise 3D maps. Scientists can now diff the landscape, which is comparing before and after LiDAR snapshots, to reveal invisible changes from the disaster. The January 2025 LA fires resulted in about 29 deaths and 60 billion US dollars in damage, and this impacted 55,000 acres of land. This area became a testing ground for LiDAR. Researchers flew LiDAR missions immediately after containment, then they compared it with the 2016 data to create some really incredible visualizations of the impact. What makes LiDAR so helpful is it can reveal the cascading disaster effects that satellites miss. Fault line shifts from earthquakes, volcanic surface changes, mudslides and debris flows after fires strip hillsides, precise vegetation loss leading to future landslide risks, and more. What's currently happening is like a reactive disaster assessment, but the idea for the future and where this technology is heading is predictive. This helps us with climate resilience. We can do real-time monitoring that can predict where the next mudslide will hit based on the vegetation loss patterns. That would be incredible. The main concern here, though, is actually budget cuts to scientific research that's happening right now. Deep tech investment is critical, but in the US, scientific innovation is at risk. 